back to my channel. That was weird. I said hi instead of hey, and it like gave me a weird feeling. Hold on. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Savannah. If you are new here, and today we are continuing our not so buried challenge. I'm excited to get back into this. It feels really good to be on like a normal schedule and like play these let's plays more than once a month. Um, I am still sick. I, if you guys are in the discord, you probably didn't know, but I had a really gnarly cold this past week. It was way worse than when I had COVID in January. Like, I don't know what happened, but I was just struggling. I'm still kind of struggling right now, but I do feel better. Um, I feel, you know that like burst of motivation you get once you get over being sick? That's kind of like where I'm at right now. <laughs> Thank you guys again for all the feedback in the comments on the last video. Um, you guys are very much for living in Strangerville, which I'm very excited for. Uh, we've actually been building uh, the Yellow Gens trailer in Strangerville on Twitch. So if you're interested in seeing that, I will be editing down the streams and uploading them to YouTube. But if you want to like watch it live and put your input, as always, my Twitch is just SimSav. And I stream Tuesdays and Thursdays, at least I try to. Um, but yeah, I'm excited for this new gen. In this episode, we're just going to be working on Prim's last uh, partners. And then we'll be focusing on Yellow Gen until she ages up into an elder. Uh, so yeah, we have a lot of time to kill. We have some things that we need to do, but, um, I'm excited. I'm excited to get into it. I'm thinking I want to move in this episode. I know that we don't have an apartment built yet, but I kind of just want to like move into one and maybe like slowly make it a red apartment. That's the plan. I hope that you guys are doing great. I'm, I'm doing good. I do have a Celsius strawberry guava as per usual, but, um, I've already drank in like this much of it because... I needed it this morning. I have a long day ahead of me. I have a long month ahead of me. I was like doing my planner yesterday and I filled everything out and I looked at it and I was like, it's gonna be a crazy month. I'm gonna try and vlog a lot of it. Try, keyword try. But yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited for this video. I'm excited to hang out with you guys today. So cheers, let's get into it. Okay guys, here we are back in the bustling world of sand my shoe. No, what's going on in here? Amber is watching TV. What are you watching though? Kids Network, good for you babes. And what are you doing? Why are you all gray? Why are you gray? Well, she's feeling tense because she hasn't been to work for a while and she's gonna do some yoga to try and relieve some of that tenseness. I gotta say I'm living for this like just just amber and her mom vibes right now it's it's giving me it's just it's making me happy i don't know why it just is <laughs> so i think what we're gonna do right now is move i just don't want to be here anymore i don't know i think that prim probably wants a fresh start and i don't blame her so i'm just gonna grab a couple things put some of these items in our inventory like this and this because that's from our mom uh, we're also gonna bring there isn't really any there isn't very many keepsakes in this house I do want to keep this bed. This bed is really cute. I'm also gonna keep this Because <laughs> memories what else we got? Anything in the kitchen that we need to bring to the new place? I Don't think so. I really d did like this apartment a lot. I'm just like over it, you know I'm just over it. You know, I'm actually gonna bring this couch and this computer. Oh, I'm gonna bring these two because I like them. I'm gonna bring this. We're gonna need this. Let's bring that. Let's bring our yoga mat. Let's just bring that too. Should we bring our bed? I do like this bed. I guess we can. Okay, yeah, that's it. So let's move. I do already know which apartment I wanna move to. Why are you thinking about a baby bottle? No, 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 no. You don't even want a kid right now. Does not want a pregnancy right now. Stop. Just stop. Stop it. Uh, right. So let's go ahead and move household. Ooh, negotiate a bonus. All right, let's go. She's like, Amber, you ready to go? The movers are coming soon. Wait, why are you holding your stomach like that? It, you're not pregnant. Why are you acting like you are? You guys saw that, right? Oh, she's on her period. Why? Uh, thinking about rattles and like holding your stomach like the God, I almost had a heart attack. I was like, when did you even woohoo? I should probably put her on birth control because she can't have any other kids. How are you guys though? Have you been sick? 
It's really going around right now. You can't afford this lot. Excuse me? It's kind of funny how the broke family is living in this three-story penthouse. <laughs> I was gonna go for that one, but I can't afford it. Hold on one second. Let me um let me just go to Manage Worlds and see how much it is. If we just need like a little bit more money, then I can wait like a day or two. Two hundred and forty-four thousand. We have a look at it really quick. Yeah, it has a massive yard. Uh, so this one's kind of nice as well. We have two bedrooms with, they both have walk-in closets, which is kind of cool. Maybe we should just do this one. Lot value. How come we can move into this one, but not the other one? That doesn't make any sense to me. This should work though. It's, there is a lot of red elements already. Maybe uh, we can move into this big one later okay so if we did move into it we would have to move in we would have to move in and sell all of the furnishings ah! okay so how much do we need how much do we need to no sixty eight thousand more dollars oh no 59 if we sell all of, all of our furniture okay so if we buy the apartment unfurnished we're gonna have thirty eight thousand dollars left to furnish the apartment which is a lot I think we should do it. Yeah, let's do it. I really do need a change of scenery. <sighs> all right, we live next door to the Fangs. It looks like the Fangs might be dead and those are all their children living there. All right, well, let's hop in, see how the apartment looks unfurnished. I'm excited. I still haven't bought my wedding stories yet. I'm still nervous. Um, I heard it's just like broken, so I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Don't forget to pay your rent on time. Um, I won't. It's fine. So that's the interest of the fangs. This is the interest to ours. Okay. Perfect. So let me just put some lights <laughs> and some essential things. Um, yeah, I can't remember the last time I like did a building video or built at all in in a video. I usually do it off camera now. All right, what is this? Why, why can't that, oh, elevator? Okay, can't build there, that's fine. I really, 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 really love this open floor plan. And I love that there is a little balcony. I think that's really nice. Changing the floor to white because red, <laughs> Red furniture looks better with white floors. I'm gonna change the uh, wall walls as well. Probably to this CC. It looks very similar, but just looks nicer. This is from the Brookstone. The Brookstone Harry. Brookstone collection by Harry. Where are those light upstairs? Ooh, those are nice too. Super modern. Ah, here we go, lit stairway. Let's get that one. Okay, we have a bunch of stuff in our inventory. <laughs> I'm kind of glad we saved some of it. Oh, a lot of this stuff is from from Andy. Who is this? Oh, that's kind of cute. I'm just grabbing all the stuff that we have in the inventory for now. Um, just so that it doesn't look so empty. Ooh, this has a red swatch. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. It looks weird. I know. You know what I think I will do? I don't, where did we get all of this like eco stuff? And why is it in our inventory? Isn't that weird? Confused I am. All right guys, I placed like a couple of essential items like kitchen, uh, I found some like bathroom stuff in our inventory. I don't know where it came from, but we have all this stuff. I don't know, I don't know. But I put out some like moving boxes everywhere to make it look like they were still moving in so that it didn't look like so weird when we were playing today. I don't know, I just kind of like that, uh, that feeling of <laughs> realism, I guess. I don't know, I just thought it looked really weird it just being like completely empty and them just like walking around. So I think the boxes do help with that. So they're still in a moving in period, okay? Let's just say that. Let's get into some more gameplay. I don't wanna waste too much time building because uh, we have a lot to do. We have a lot to do in this Let's Play and I really wanna just like get through it. Ooh, look at how pretty the clouds are. Yeah, it, mm-hmm. 
This apartment has a great view trait. Definitely has a great view. Can you please stop thinking about baby stuff? Like, please. She's acting like she's pregnant, but she's not. She's just on her period. <laughs> Your social skill is almost maxed. No, you're not gonna troll the forums. What are you off to do? Man, she really, 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 really likes doing yoga. Why don't you come over here and just work on your social skill a little bit while while she does the yogi? Wow, look at this view. They were not kidding. This is absolutely beautiful. Oh, there she goes. She Wow, so easy. Okay, let's work on your mental skill now. So why don't you come over here and just experiment? Uh, what are you doing? Nap, that's not your bed though. That's not your bed. We maxed your career. We reached level 10 charisma. Now we just need to work on your aspiration. Right, there was this girl that we were, was it Chana? No, Danielle. We were trying to woo Danielle. So, is she here? She must be in the city somewhere. Oh, okay, she's down here getting food. Huh. Wait, oh, you're working. Okay, okay. And we have work and school, so I guess we can like hit you up after work. Right, let's just go to the bathroom and have a snack before school. Cereal, cereal. This new apartment is so exciting. I love all the moving in boxes. It's fun. All right, I'll let you nap before work, but now you gotta go. You gotta go. You gotta, you're, you're stressed from work withdrawals, so go to work so you're not stressed anymore. Oh, now she's focused and happy. See? I wish I had that kind of work ethic, for real though. Okay, what happened? What? Okay, bills have been delivered, $5,000. No problem, no problem, no problem. Can do. Primrose has a major deadline. Ask for help. Don't hide in the closet. Mm -mm. Who's this? <gasps> the maid's here. You have one bowl to clean up, and that's it. That'll be $0. Thanks! Appreciate you cleaning that bowl for me for free. It's real sweet of you. I really want to work on uh, Amber and Brendan's relationship. And also, her relationship with Senior Pollination Technician number three. One of you guys commented that we should give her a real name. <laughs> Let me know what you guys think about that. I'm a, I'm a little bit intrigued. Who's Todd? Where did you meet Todd? Huh. I like Brendan better. I think that should be our one and only friend. So maybe we can invite him over today to like play toys or something. Oh, but she's tired. Grades are up, you're an A student. We got $3,000 today and a lovely school project. So, I'm gonna get you, what does this do again? I don't even know, but I'm gonna get you to like have some sleep because you need it. She's confident from what? Killer school day? Decorated, kinda, good grades, the good days from toddlerhood. I'm glad you're happy, baby. Oh, Olivia's calling. I've been pondering your advice and you're right. I should be doing what makes me happy so I switch careers. I need to stop doing this. I keep telling Sims to switch their careers without even realizing I'm doing it. So Olivia wants to be an entertainer. Okay, well that's kind of cool. So we need, we need feminine products. We were at work without any feminine products today in a skirt, but darling, no. Go to the wonderful store, please. Let's get you some birth control while you're there. Let's get you some of those and this. And this too. All right, welcome back. Oh, welcome wagon? Okay. Um, I guess y'all can come in. Invite neighbors in. Let me just, let me just put this thingy in first. One second, please. Also, let's take a chill pill. Hopefully that'll make us feel better. I don't know. Welcome in. Hi, everybody. Uh, what do you have to do? Flush and use the pad. Okay. All right. Who do we got here? Umbra. Susanna Gretchen. Oh, Gretchen Hi, Fang. Dad. Great new neighbor. Um, <laughs> polite introduction. Benzu. Yeah, we need to like <laughs> rock your body and mind. Okay, come on, let's just introduce ourselves to all of these people. It's kind of overwhelming, but hey, because we're, we're really not feeling well. Soul Soul Maladay, glad we got a chance to chat. Yeah, same. Zag, 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 zag. 
Daggy, dag, dag, daggy, dag. dag. Are you feeling confident from? Expert career consultant and polite is right from polite introduction. Okay, cool. Pretend to be slapped. What is that? Okay, babes, you really need a shower. So let's, let's not. Let's just have a shower really quick. They came at a really bad time. Oh no, Amber, there's something under your bed. Why don't we uh, talk to it? Amber was unsuccessful. No. Oh well, let's just experiment then. Let's have a look at the calendar and see what's up. We got GeekCon today. Uh, let's see, what else? Not much, nothing really. Amber's birthday is in four days, which is exciting. But that's pretty much it. We just need to work on uh, Prim's aspiration. Do you have work? You don't, or you do. You have work today, but you don't have work tomorrow. So we can probably get to work on the aspiration tomorrow. I do want to cuff Danielle, and then the, for the... It says we only need two more, but I kind of cheated because it should be three more because Sai... We divorced Sai and then like asked him to be our boyfriend again, and it counted for one because I wanted to like get or like re-engage so that I could actually leave him at the altar in the last episode. So I don't know. I don't know. Also, I would like to spend more time with my brothers, and I think that the easiest way to do that is probably by making... Let's add them to the babysitter club. And then whenever I want to see them, I can just like start a club gathering. I hate that like not everyone we know shows up in this uh, ad club members thing. Maybe I should just summon them. Yeah. Let's get up. Let's invite Thorn to the babysitter club. Hey, brother. You want to babysit for me when I got to go to work and stuff? What you think? What you think? Where are my other brothers? Hey, get your booty over here. He's like, are you kidding? I'd love to babysit Amber. Thanks, brother. You the best. All right, who's left? Bud, right, the one that we have kind of a negative relationship with, which is kind of interesting. Hey! Oh my god, they all look so similar. It's kind of funny. I should probably give them a makeover, guys, huh? I probably should. Whoa, look at all of them! No, I don't think that babysitter's for me. I'm sorry, but you don't have a choice. You don't have a choice. I've never heard someone, I've never seen a sim turn down a club invite before. Guys, look at all of our alien brothers! I can't tell which one is the most handsome. You know what's funny? Isn't Bud the one we grew up with? I wonder why we have a negative relationship with him. Or was it Thorn? I can't remember which one came first. They're all so pretty though. Oh yes, he'd love to join. Okay, I'm sorry bud, but you don't have a choice. Or do we need like a certain amount of relationship for them to join a club? I mean, maybe we just don't get along with him and that's fine. It's kind of sad though. He 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 he. They all have the same hair. The same ears and the same outfit. Does Bud have? Yeah! That's hilarious! And they all have piercings too. They fascinate me. I almost don't want to give them makeovers because of how, how interesting they are. <laughs> Okay, so they're at work and school. When Primrose gets back, we're gonna work on this aspiration and get that done so that we can fully focus on Amber. Oh, Graceland Gupta was adopted by the Silver Sweater household. How cute! Yeah, what's up? Kaz Kazuki Wada has passed away. Who's Kazuki? Who's that? Are we gonna get a raise today probably i really hope so oh no not the fangs woohooing wait isn't it their kids that live there i'm gonna pretend like that's not happening yay we got a raise let's go an additional 14 an hour we love to see it Sai is wondering if i want to go to his house and hang out oh it's amber yeah yeah we should probably go definitely we're just gonna go over and then i'm gonna switch controls Switch control to Prim. Oh my God, I can't speak. <laughs> and we're going to uh, secure Danielle as our GF. And then 
work on making Olivia our girlfriend too. I guess she can be our last one. Although I should probably get two more since that's technically what I need. I don't want to cheat. Hi, Dad. I'm tired. I'm tired and I'm dirty. Can you take care of me, please? Okay, bye, Amber. Have fun. Have a good time with your daddy. That's cute that he invited her over. I love that. He seems to be a good man. This girl is so high maintenance, I swear. She's tense because she's not working. She's tense because now she needs a vacation. Like, which is it? Sheesh. <sighs> All right, Danielle, get your booty over here. Let's hang out. Let's freaking chill. Hey girl, what a cute little outfit you've got on. Let's vent. Tell funny story. She seems to be tense as well. Let's see, let's have a look. Yeah, she is. Let's sit and chat on the couch, shall we? Yes, Lacey, what? We've been thinking about trying for, who are you? Decide for yourself. Oh my God, what? Skyla, I, why are so many people hitting us up today? All these people that I don't know. You better not be going to our computer. Yeah, you better come back, lady. Let's beguile her. Let's just put her in the mood because she's kind of being, she's kind of being, what's the word? Difficult. <laughs> All right, come on, Prim. Let's turn on the charm, baby. Let's go. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we are, Arnold. <laughs> oh, first kiss. First kiss. First kiss. First kiss. Mwah, mwah. Kiss me, please, love. She's so cute. Look at that little nose. I'm a little bit obsessed with her. She's adorable. What are you about to grill? No, no grilling. No grilling. No. I don't want no scrub. Scrub is a guy that can't get no love from me. Hanging at the passenger side of his best friend's ride. Trying to holler at me. Woohoo, and shower? I mean, sure, why not, you know? It's been a while. It's been a while for her. Danielle used a condom. Oh, okay. We discovered something about Danielle today. Oh, welcome home. How was your dad's? Did he feed you? Oh, good, he fed you. And he bathed you. But you're just very tired. Okay, good night, love. Fireworks? Oh, they're cute and they're matching checkered vans. I love that for y'all. Yes, in this giant empty bathroom. Ask to be girlfriend. So what you think? You wanna make this thing official? Baby? So giddy. All right, mission accomplished. Two more, two more if I'm being, if I'm being correct. Chana yeah, Lachin, I mean, we have a little bit of romance with you. <laughs> oh Lord, no. I kind of want you to leave now. Have a good night, Danny. I'll see you next time. Okay, who's next? Shingo or Chana? I'm thinking Chana. Hello. Let's just offer you a rose right quick. Good to see you, I got you this. <laughs> Oh no, you're hungry? Okay, let's cook dinner for y'all. Let's do that. Oh, we don't have a stove. <laughs> we could cook something like a salad. How about that? Fruit salad or onigiri? Let's do that. Let's do a party size of this. That sounds good. You wanna come in for dinner? Come on in, love. Come on in. Sorry about the mess. We're still moving in. Are you gonna come in or not? Why are you being weird? Come in with your water shoes. Are you not gonna, are you really not gonna come in? Get your butt in here. Come and eat, I made food. Grab some. It's delicious, I promise. Aww. What in the world? She's cute. She definitely has potential. It's just a lot of CC, uh, unmatching CC, you know? Okay, we can do first kiss. Let's get that, let's get that done. Let's have some, oh my God, I want that. I don't even know what it is, but I want it. I love rice. Oh God, I could eat rice for every meal. Just a nice cup of rice with some soy sauce. Oh, 
You know what I've been doing lately with my sushi? I normally don't eat the ginger that comes with sushi, but I've been putting the ginger on my sushi. Just like a little piece on top of each pe on top of each little roll. So freaking good. Ask me, girlfriend. Let's get it. Yes. 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 Yes, yes, yes. Okay, it says we completed the aspiration, but we technically didn't. The aspiration will be done when we get... Yes, goodbye. We'll see you later. When we get Olivia to be our girl. So, we will work on that tomorrow. We'll go on a date with her because we do have the day off. Uh, and uh, hopefully it goes well. It needs to be someplace romantic. Fingers crossed. Okay, how you doing, love? Your energy's up there. You're almost gonna get up. Okay. Good morning, babes. Wash your hands, brush your teeth, get some water. Cute. I wish her toothbrush was yellow. <laughs> All right, let's get some breakfast. What do you want for breakfast? What do you want? What do you want? There's some onigiri here. Uh, I guess that's what we're having for breakfast. It's fine. It's all good. <laughs> I wouldn't mind. Oh, you're drinking your water? Okay. Stay hydrated, queen. Oh, you have school today. Dang it. We really need to finish this project. Oh, good morning, Prim. Why are you up? Oh, you're okay. You're good. You need lotion, though. Let's put on some deodorant, too. Oh, she's feeling confident from that. Nice and fresh. You love to see it. Also, thank you for doing the dishes, babes. Crap, she still hasn't finished her school project. And she didn't do her homework. Ah! Watch news? I guess that makes sense, since you're a politician. Oh, she's thinking about Andy. Aww. I heard you and Bob. Wait, Bob? Who's Bob? Word travels fast, but like, who's Bob? Bob Cotter? I don't remember that, but okay. All right, let's just uh, invite Olivia over and then um, ask her if she wants to like go out. It's Tessa and Amber's so nervous. She totally blanks. Even copying her neighbor won't work because her neighbor's a D student. What to do, feign illness or just take deep breaths? Just take deep breaths. It worked. Oh God. Oh God, she's pregnant! Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> Is that your first baby? I'm having like flashbacks of Andy and Alice. She does have a kid. Oh shoot. Well, let's just ask her to feel the baby, I guess. People peeling away? Can Primrose truly call herself a people person when her friendships come apart so easily? What do you mean? Hey, you're <laughs> <laughs> no, Let's ask her on a date. Uh, I think she just transitioned into second trimester right in front of our eyes. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go to this cafe because it is still a little bit early. Oh my God, I can't believe she's pregnant. I guess that's fine. I just feel bad. I feel bad telling her to break up with her partner when she's gonna have a baby. Oh, Lord. Oh, I forgot. I love this freaking lot so much. Let's just compliment her appearance here. They have a little bit of romance now, which is exciting. Okay, we can have a first kiss now. First kiss. Oh, God. She, this guy's getting chewed out by his girlfriend over there. Did you cheat? What did you do? Come on, kiss. I know you want to. Oh, look, there's a gold guy over there. Oh, oh. Oh my god. Oh, man. Okay. So, wow. Ask to be girlfriend, please. She said yes. She obviously doesn't care about her 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 husband. Very awkward encounter. Is it because everyone's staring? Oh, you're cute. I like you. All right, what's going on here? Is this broken? Can we not? We gotta make our own drink. I guess that's fine. All right, we made ourselves a drink. Where are we going? Why are you gonna sit here? You know, you need to sit with Olivia. Look at her with the little in the breath, though. It's so cute. 
She's adorable. I love her and everything that she does. Who's this? Hi, sit with me. No, why do we always have to get blocked? Every time. Oh, who's this? What a cutie pie. Oh my gosh, what a cutie. Oh my gosh. Stop it, I love your outfit. Oh no, it's raining. Oh, hey, Heidi. Let's give her an apartment key and head home. She's like, hey, here's my uh, apartment key. I'm gonna go home if you wanna come hang out. I will be there. She's like, oh, hey, Heidi. See ya. Heidi did not look happy that we were there with Olivia. All right, babes, welcome home. I hope you're feeling good about how today went even though we got rained out. Typical. What do you mean it's game night? I'm sorry, you're not bringing people to my house, are you, Olivia? Are you bringing people here or is it just you? She actually showed up. I gave her a key and I said, I'm gonna go to my apartment, come by if you want. And she actually showed up. That's crazy, why don't we all just like watch a movie? I don't know why Amber is watching something called College Cram, but. It's fine. Oh, she got some juice. We're vibing, watching a movie. How cute. Aw, I love them. They're adorable. I guess we should probably make dinner. Uh, we don't have a stove still, so. We're gonna have to cook something that we don't actually cook. Um, what are our options? Ooh, watermelon salad, let's freaking go! Olivia's like really thirsty. She got some juice and now she has some water. And I wish this item was usable. Yes, we'll donate to charity, of course. No, I don't wanna hang out with you. We, have, we already have guests over, I'm sorry. Wait, did Olivia leave? Oh, I think she left. I think she might have peed herself. I don't know where this puddle came from. I'm also gonna put this up in Amber's room. It's like a little nightlight. It's really cute. So how are you liking the new apartment, babe? Are you having fun here? <laughs> oh, little hug! So cute. Ask about school. All right, babe, I'm gonna need you to do your homework real quick and then you can head to sleep. And then, um, what then? We already did Prim's aspiration, so we're done. I think we should break up with everyone except for Olivia. Maybe we should move Olivia in. I wonder if she would bring her kids. I wonder how, I wonder what that would be like. This is such a vibey apartment. I love Amber's room, even though it's not even done yet. It just has like a nice vibe to it. Look at these lit stairs too. These are so cool. I freaking love those. They're from Get Famous, by the way. Oh crap, the watermelon salad. It's kind of crazy. We have nothing left to do with Prim except for get married when she becomes an elder. It's so wild to me. I'm really thinking, where do you live, babes? Where do you live? Modern industrial house? Where's that though? Let's spend uh, Prim's aspiration points as well. What would assist her in her career? What do you guys think? Let's get her incredibly friendly. I think that aligns very well with it. Should we get her a new aspiration? Should we do the soulmate one? Yeah, let's do that. I'm gonna get... <laughs> I'm gonna get all of our uh, people that we just became uh, boyfriends and girlfriends with, or that we just became girlfriends with. I'm gonna have to break up with them. No, maybe we should just ask to be friends. I don't want there to be any bad blood. You know, things move pretty fast. No! Oh my God, why do they do that? Why do they freaking do that? Hey, don't kiss. Okay, they're hugging, that's fine. All right, so stop it! Oh God! Okay, did, did you care? Cause we're just friends? 
No, it's just a, it's just an awkward encounter. Which makes sense. And then this Bob Cotter person. Why do I feel like we might be we might be together? Let me just double check. Oh yeah, we are. I don't I don't even freaking remember that, but. We just gonna be friends, okay? Stop kissing everyone before you break up with them. Jeez. Okay, goodbye everybody. I am no longer interested in being in an open relationship with you all. So I'll see you next time. Okay, she's feeling confident about that. Good, I'm glad. Have a great day at work, love. I, <laughs> I just love making my life difficult. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking I want to move in Olivia and her kid. I don't know why, I just kind of do. If they're in love, if they feel like they're soulmates, wouldn't she be like, leave your husband and come live with me? I'm like kind of intrigued to see like what her kids are like as well. Let's start a babysitting club gathering right quick. Um, is it really almost Amber? Oh yeah, it's in two days. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Yes, welcome, welcome boys, welcome. Whoa, let me look at that outfit first. Uh, I love that. I love it. Amber's feeling sick for some reason. But I can't get them to throw up. What, Sai? Oh my god! I have a crush on you. Are you being sarcastic? Are you just being a, a asshole? Or are you just like trying to get his back? Should we ghost him? I think we need to ghost him. You're not responding, does that mean you don't want to hang out? Yeah, that's exactly what it means. Jeez, she might be spiraling, I don't know. What do you guys think? I was thinking about checking out the city today. Can I use your place to get ready? Yeah, I was actually just gonna hit you up. Uh, so I wanted to talk to you about I wanted to talk to you about you leaving your spells. Maybe we shouldn't do this here. Let's um, let's just wash your hands and then ask her on a date. We can go like go eat or something and talk about it there. My brothers are here that watch Amber. Let's go to the park. Let's just go for a walk. Okie dokie. Well, let's toss a coin. Toss a coin to your Witcher. Wait, why are we? Why do we have smooth apology? Did you do something? Oh, I'm so sorry. What did we do? Pusheen. This is a really cute park. I will not lie. I like it a lot. Look, there's a little gym area over here. Uh, there's a cooler, a place of fish. Wait, what's up? Oh, this is a cute little bridge. Oh my gosh. Let's let's talk over here. Oh. Why are we a one-star celebrity? What did we do? Oh, did you streak? Oh God, this is like a really, really, really romantic bridge. Um, really romantic, actually. Holy can like look at this. Bang. Wow, yeah, this is gorgeous. This is definitely somewhere to propose to someone, absolutely. I don't know, I don't remember who built this, but it's gorgeous. Let's profess, profess undying love to her on this bridge. Wow. Let me see if we can convince her. Ask what Olivia's problem is. No, no, no. But Mo not having used birth control? She'd be like, you knew we were gonna be together. Why did you have to go and get pregnant? That just complicates things. Oh my god. I'm not gonna tell her to do that, but like, wow. What if she did? Commits to leave spouse. Hopefully it's not bugged still. Leave him! Leave him! Please! Okay, it worked. I feel like you just get me. Aww. It's kind of like what happened with Andy and Alice. Like, I'm pretty sure Andy convinced Alice to leave her husband. And we were gonna move her in with her kid, but we decided not to for some reason. It's kind of like a repeat. 
So tomorrow is Amber's birthday. I'm definitely going to be playing until, um, until they age up. This stupid monster under the bed will not leave us alone. Look at all these salads that Thorn made. It's clearly all he knows how to make. <laughs> so he just made a bunch of it, which is kind of cute. Honestly, I'm not gonna lie. Alrighty, have a good day at school today, babe. Study hard. And you, have a good day at work. Work hard. Work hard, play hard. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna wait until, uh, I'm, I'm gonna wait and see. Oh, hey, you had your baby. <gasps> Exciting. She's feeling sad. I wonder if she left her husband. And she came by to tell us, but we weren't here. Dang it, she left. We were about to write, we were about to come home right now. Oh, we got another raise, let's go. Sai wants to come over. I guess so, if you really need to. Who, get out! Who even are you? God, I need to lock the door. Hi, Dad. Maybe we should give him a key too, just in case. Or should we? Do we want him coming over all the time? Hi, Dad. Aww. Oh, I want to cry. Uh-oh, Olivia's here. I mean, it's not a bad thing, but Sai is also here. I don't know. Let's just ask her about her day, though. Let's invite her to stay the night. Um, I wonder if she left her husband yet. This is very awkward. Please don't be romantic with each other. Please don't ruin things right now. Honestly, I should probably send him home. No! No! <laughs> Is there a way to see if she left her spouse? I think she did. She did! Let's go! I'm like very intrigued to see her family. Let me just go really quick. Let me try and figure out where she lives. She probably lives where um, Alice and Eric lived, which is in... Isn't that Willow Creek? Oh yeah, I remember now. Why is it just you two? Where's your child? Hang on a second, I need to do some investigating. Some sleuthing, if you will. I'm too nosy, I need to know what we're getting ourselves into. All right, you need to come back, Olivia. Uh, your husband is actually very handsome. Uh, and she's, oh crap, yeah, they did get a divorce. Oh God, okay. Uh, so the baby's name is Mercedes, and I believe it's a girl, right? Mercedes, girl, yeah. Where's your other kid? Who is Roger? Oh, Roger's your kid. Oh, right. John was your, oh crap. Drama. Okay, let me look at this really quick. Oh, Roger's your brother? You had a brother? Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I remember now. I remember now. Okay, so you have Mercedes and Duke. Where the heck is Duke at? Did he go with? <gasps> oh my God, he already has another spouse. Jeez, that was so fast. Did Duke go with you? He must have. Duke must live with you. Okay, so if Olivia did come, she would just bring the baby, not Duke. Very, very interesting. Where does Duke live? It's a good house, where's that? Oh crap, I can play this household straight from the MC Command Center menu? Okay, let's do that. Wow, okay, she lives with her brother. Interesting. I wonder if she like moved in with her brother when they divorced. That kind of makes sense. Everything's coming together. Okay, yeah. Girl, I don't give a crap. You do what you gotta do, I don't care. So this is Olivia's ex. Yeah, he's not bad looking, definitely not. This is her her other son. Oh my God, stop, he's so cute. He is so freaking cute. Okay, so yeah, you did take Duke with you, wow. Where are they, where is this? Is this Brindleton Bay? Where are we right now? Yeah, it's Brindleton. Okay, so they live in Brindleton with daddy and stepmommy. 
What's she like? Vicarious, overachiever, and a geek. What was her husband like? Antiseptic, shameless, and snob? And Duke is a cat lover. All right then. I can't believe he took the kid. I wonder if they were just like, you take Duke and I'll take Mercedes. Oh, wow, that's a lot of money. Yeah, I'm gonna do this. It only makes sense. We can't be like, hey, Olivia, you should leave your husband. And then be like, but you can't move in with us. She can't just live with her brother. I mean, she could, but like, what's the point if we're just gonna marry her eventually, you know? It would probably be for the best because if we don't move Olivia in, there's a big, big chance that she's just gonna go off and marry someone else because my sims are wild like that. Andy is a great example of that. And I think it would be fun to have, have a baby around. Um, yeah, it just seems like the right move. So we're gonna do it. I'm sorry if y'all disagree or you just don't want me to. It just feels, it feels right. It just feels right. Welcome to your new home. I hope that you enjoy it. <sighs> Babies, am I right? Oh, Olivia is a bad cook. Would be happy to be pregnant. Okay. Hey, Amber, why don't you introduce yourself to the baby? This is your uh, new stepsister. Exciting. Oh God, she's angry. Oh, from Noisy Neighbors. Okay. I was like, I thought I thought she was angry because of the, uh, the, the new situation she's found herself in. Not politely. They need to become BFFs for her aspiration. She wants to marry her best friend. So let's, uh, let's just get that done. Oh god, she's gonna angrily ask her to be our bestie. Oh, <sighs> what are you sad from? Shared sadness from a close sentiment towards someone feeling bad. What the heck happened? Why'd you get negative? Oh my god, are you being mean, Prim? Prim is actually, like, not very nice. I'm not gonna lie. I'm, like, noticing that. I don't know if it's because she's hot-headed or what, but... About! Today is Amber's birthday! Oh my gosh, we need to max this mental skill before we before we age her up. I'm perfect. It's a Saturday. So I'm thinking we just have, like, a little, a little thing here at the house. Uh, do you have work today? No, you don't. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna make a cake. Clean out the spoiled food first. Oh crap, we need it. We need a stove. I need to buy one. Hold on. Okay, cool. I was able to stick one right there. Let's go, Amber. Maxing that mental skill. Yay! Yeah, yeah. Uh, let's do. I kind of want to do a zombie cake for her. Zombler cake. Where is that again? So we're just gonna be invi inviting Brendan over. Uh, we can get. Should we get like a don't wake the llama table or? We. I, I, I want to do so. I want to have. Blah, blah, blah. I want them to do something fun together. Okay, we're ready for a very half. Just moved in birthday party, but it's fine. It'll be cute. Oh, cute little zombie cake. I love it. Add candles. Oh, Roger's calling. What's up? Yeah, we could chat. Probably just checking on us. Roger has spread some juicy gossip about Mercedes. Our baby? Oh, God. What did you make? Poor quality cereal marshmallow squares. I mean, you tried. Uh, blah, 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 Olivia, you tried. Amber, I'm going to need you to invite over your friend here. Your friend. Uh, oh crap, he aged up. Well, I guess that's perfect. Cause we're about to age up too. So let's get them over here. Let's get the brothers over here. And also we got to invite Bud. Cause he didn't want to join the club. Oh, he's here. Hi. Yes. It's so funny that they're a different age right now. It makes me laugh. All right, well. What are you doing to this cake? This, this is not yours. I wonder, can you give a puppet show? Or is it the kids that go in there? Pe perform puppet show! Uh, let's do my pet monster for all these people here. Okay, for some reason I thought it was the adults that put on the show for the, for the kids, but apparently it's the other way around. Have you guys ever seen this before? It's kind of disturbing. It looks like Brendan's really into it though. Are you? Oh, he is. 
<laughs> oh no, Prim, no! Ah! I don't want that. I don't want her to have that. Stop making eggs and toast, Thorn, please! All right, it's game time. Let's play. It is time. Happy birthday, my love. She's so cute. The color palette right here is making me happy. Well. Are you gonna age up? What's going on? Oh, we got a preteen. This is our first preteen. Welcome Amber Barry to preteen for the next couple of years. You're going to be experiencing some changes. Don't worry, Amber is completely natural. You do just fine. Uh, and she's gonna have her first period. I caramba. Okay, um, what was the other trait that we needed to have? Was it ambitious? Clumsy, ambitious, and loner. Okay. So, I'm thinking this one we should do clumsy because ambitious doesn't really matter until you're an adult, right? Because you like with the promotions and stuff. And then the aspiration is nerd brain. All right. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Let me have a look at you, babe. She's freaking beautiful. She's a preteen, so she's like... It's pretty cool. This mod adjusts the height of the Sims, which is nice. So when they age up into a, a preteen or a teen, they um, aren't as tall as the other Sims, which is kind of cool. So let's head into cast. I'm going to end this episode with a little makeover. Vini Guma. All right. Let's have a look at you. Oh, you're so small. Shoot. Okay. This is the only thing that sucks. <laughs> I can't properly edit you. She is so, so, so beautiful though. I'm so excited, guys. Really vibing this hair. I think it's really adorable. Universal Citizen. That's kind of fun. It's got like a little like uh, Milky Way on there. This is perfect for her because she's obsessed with space. This has like constellation constellations on the sleeve. That's perfect. Hey guys, editing Sav here. I just realized that I didn't dress her in yellow clothes. And this is the yellow gen. It just completely slipped my mind. I was just very distracted. <laughs> so I promise I will dress her in yellow um, before the next episode. I just wanted to let y'all know that I forgot and I will fix it. I promise. Okay, resume the video. I like this checkered with the stripes. <laughs> I don't know why, but it's speaking to me. Okay, so I think that we are done then. Well, I hope that you guys like them. I'm obsessed. I'm, I'm gonna have so much fun with this generation. I cannot wait to move to Strangerville. Well, I'm gonna leave this part right here. I love you guys so much. If you would like, follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!